Hey there, I'm Lindsay Divin, and I'm passionate about everything marketing, productivity, and career growth. With over 17 years of experience in the architecture, engineering, and construction industry, I know firsthand the ins and the outs of this exciting field. From my early days as a marketing coordinator to becoming an award-winning marketing professional and firm principal, I've learned the ropes through countless late nights and challenging deadlines. Now, I'm thrilled to bring you the AEC Marketing Strategies Podcast. Here, I'll be sharing simple yet powerful step-by-step marketing strategies that you can implement to achieve the same level of success. Consider me your go-to marketing mentor, someone who truly gets the unique challenges you face in the AEC industry. Whether you're an AEC marketing pro or industry newbie, this podcast is your personal coffee date with your marketing bestie. Together, we'll navigate the ever-changing landscape of online marketing and digital trends, ensuring you stay ahead of the curve. If you're ready to unlock the marketing secrets they never taught you in college and tailor them specifically to the AEC industry, then you're in the right place. Now, let's get started. Welcome to AEC Marketing Strategies, the podcast where we dive deep into the world of architecture, engineering, and construction marketing. I'm your host, Lindsay Divin, and today's episode kicks off a brand new series called Branded, How to Build and Manage Your AEC Firm's Online Brand. This series includes four bonus episodes to walk you through the steps to create and manage online marketing assets to maintain a consistent brand experience online. The branded series is presented by Open Asset. Open Asset's project-based digital asset management platform empowers AEC and real estate firms to create high quality online brand assets and RFP responses quickly and easily. To learn more about Open Asset, go ahead and visit www.marketerstakeflight.com forward slash open asset. Okay, so now let's jump into today's topic. What is an online brand and why does it matter for your AEC firm? In this digital age, your brand is more than just your logo or your tagline. It's the entire experience that your audience has when they interact with your firm online. So what does it mean when I say online or online brand? Your online brand encompasses not just your website, but your social media profiles, your online content, and the overall perception of your firm in the digital space, in the World Wide Web. It's how you present yourself or your firm and your expertise to the world and how you differentiate your firm from your competition. And so we all know that we need to build we, we need to be in the digital age, right? And, we, and part of this is building a strong online brand. And we know that it's more important than ever. And, but maybe we don't know why, right? Maybe you just hear that it's important. So I want to go through, before I go through how to build your online brand, I want to talk about some of the benefits, you know, so going the benefits beyond just having a pretty logo or a catchy tagline Digital branding goes beyond that, and it really has some incredible benefits for your AEC firm. So let me go through some of those real fast. The first benefit is recognition. When your brand is strong and consistent across all digital platforms, it becomes easily recognizable. Think about it. When you see those golden arches, you immediately know it's McDonald's. When you see that round green mermaid logo, you know it's Starbucks. Now, I know our firms aren't Starbucks or McDonald's, but you can take the benefit of recognition can still apply to your AEC firm. Is your online brand simple and minimalistic or something wild and eye-popping? Can your employees, clients, and potential clients pick it out quickly? So you should work to get your brand recognized in the sea of all of your competitors, other engineering firms, other architecture firms, et cetera, et cetera. And so you can do this by by making sure that everyone on your team knows your value proposition 
and can quickly articulate how your brand stands out from your competitors. Building a recognizable brand helps potential clients and potential employees identify and choose your firm over the the competition. So another benefit is reputation. In today's digital world, online reviews and peer recommendations carry significant weight. We all know word of mouth and referrals offline are very important, but a lot of those are coming online. And so having a positive online reputation can make or break your AEC firm. When people trust your brand, they are more likely to choose your services. So focus on building a strong reputation by delivering exceptional work. That's, you know, the threshold, right? Exceptional work. That's the baseline. But then actively engaging with your audience online, including your partners, clients, and community agencies. That's where you mark you as an AEC marketer can help your firm with the online reputation. Next up is brand loyalty. Brand loyalty is another crucial benefit of digital branding. When you build a brand that resonates with your audience and consistent, consistently delivers value, you cultivate a loyal client base as well as a strong employee base. And to help you do this, um, to help build brand loyalty, it helps to develop a story around your brand that is authentic and relatable. For example, at Full Sail Partners, we don't take ourselves too seriously. We do serious work, but we have fun. We like to have fun. We are not corporate. That's kind of our motto. And so you'll you'll often see us. We'll be the first ones up to sing karaoke at any conference. And so our marketing team tries to make sure that this comes across in all of our online brand elements and shapes our virtual events like our summer, the summer's Vantage Point demo series, where we've themed it all a uh, dashboard palooza, like we're hosting some kind of online music festival. We're talking about Vantage Point dashboards, people. This isn't like super exciting, but we've created the, the online branding experience. And even our consultants have gotten into the fun with like naming their projects and their dashboards after music themed projects. So Our clients have come to know this. This is really authentic to who our consultants are, who are our people who make up our our company. And our clients have come to know this and they really expect us to be a little bit fun and a little bit wild, especially at our in-person events. So look at your digital assets, things like your logo, your mission, your value statement, your visuals, and your copy, the actual text. Are they authentic for what your firm stands for and is actually like? Is it relatable to your clients? You know, we are more loyal to the brands that we personally identify with. And your clients are no different. If you're not sure how to bridge that gap uh, between your online brand and your clients, start by identifying the values of your clients or in marketing speak, persona or personas that you're trying to reach online. This should provide a good starting point to better understand your audience's motivations, behaviors, and concerns. And if you haven't done this work before, this is this persona work is new to you, or you need just need a refresher, I've got two episodes for you to check out. First is episode 74, Define Personas to Guide Marketing Strategies. And the second is episode 98, the power of clarity, how to stand out from your competi- your competitors and attract your ideal clients. You can find both at marketerstakeflight.com forward slash 74 and marketerstakeflight.com forward slash 98. So turning clients and employees into advocates for your brand helps your firm because they not only keep spreading your messages, but it also helps to attract new clients and new employees out there online. Another thing uh, is consistency is key when it comes to digital branding. By presenting a unified image across all your digital platforms, you create a sense of trust and reliability. Consistency in your messaging, in your visuals, and your values it helps your audience understand what your firm stands for and builds that str- and helps to build that strong brand, brand identity. 
In the third episode of the series, I'm going to detail some ways to help you maintain a consistent brand experience online. So hit that subscribe button so you don't miss that episode. Now, let's talk about brand equity, which is another benefit of building a strong online brand. Your brand's value goes beyond just your projects or your services. It's about the emotional connection and positive, hopefully positive experiences you create for your audience. When your brand resonates with people and just makes them feel good or confident or you you know your firm's got this, it increases your brand's equity and makes you more valuable in the marketplace. Digital branding also plays a significant role in attracting top talent to your firm, which is a major problem for all of our AEC firms. In fact, according to this year's Delta Clarity study, 90% of the firms surveyed rank the ability to find good candidates as one of their top three challenges. And that same study showed that firms are getting better at using social media for talent acquisition. When you have a strong and well-established online brand, it becomes a magnet for talented professionals who want to be part of something great or who want to avoid FOMO, that fear of missing out. Your online brand reputation and culture can be powerful recruitment tools in our industry where finding qualified workers is a challenge and will be a challenge for the foreseeable future. And then last but not least, digital branding can help your help you differentiate your firm from your competitors. When you consistently present your brand across all digital platforms and deliver exceptional experiences, you stand out from the crowd. A strong digital brand can increase your revenue, differentiate you from your competitors, and position you as an industry leader. So as you can see, digital branding has numerous benefits for AEC firms. It helps you gain recognition, improves your reputation, builds loyalty, increases brand equity, attracts top talent, and helps you differentiate yourself from your competitors. Now that we understand the importance of an online brand, let's talk a bit more in detail about how you can leverage it to stand out. First and foremost, it's essential to have a well-designed and user-friendly website. Your website should not only look visually appealing, but also provide valuable content that addresses your audience's pain points and positions your firm as an industry leader. Next, you need to establish a strong social media presence. Choose the platforms that are most relevant to your target audience and consistently share content that showcases your expertise, highlights your progress, your highlights your projects or progress and engages with your followers. Remember, social media is not just about self-promotion. It's about building relationships and providing value to your audience. Another way to leverage your online brand is through content marketing. Create blog posts, videos, or podcasts, my favorite podcasts, that offer insights and solutions to your audience's challenge. By providing this valuable content, you position your firm as a trusted resources, a trusted resource and build credibility within the industry. To learn more about the different content types, I've got two more episodes for you. Episode 78, Content Ideas to Fuel Your Marketing, and Episode 99, The Pros and Cons of Different Content Types. And then lastly, don't forget the power of online reviews and testimonials. Encourage your satisfied clients or employees to leave reviews and recommendations on platforms like Google Business Profile, which was formerly Google My Business, or LinkedIn and or LinkedIn. I know a lot of us ask for client feedback and we get that and we kind of just hold on to it. But we need to start building some online reviews and testimonials as well. And these positive reviews not only boost your online reputation, but also help potential clients trust in your abilities. Bonus to accumulating reviews 
online on these sites that is that it also helps your SEO too, your SEO rankings as well. So to wrap up, your online brand is more than just a pretty website or a catchy tagline or a really cool logo. It's the entire experience that your audience has when they interact with your firm online. And in our very competitive AEC industry, a strong online brand can be the differentiating factor that sets you apart from your competitors because not a lot of firms are doing this. So you could get that first mover advantage just from today's episode in these bonus episodes that I'm going to be walking you through over the next couple of weeks. So take the time to evaluate your current online brand and identify areas for improvement. Leverage your website, social media, and content marketing efforts to create a cohesive and impactful online presence that resonates with your audience. And remember, this is just the first in my new series, Branded, How to Build and Manage Your AEC Firm's Online Brand. Over the next three episodes, I'll be sharing how to create effective online marketing assets, how to maintain consistent brand experience, and how to manage all of this content more efficiently. And this branded series is made possible by Open Asset, the industry-leading digital asset management solution for AEC firms. To learn more about Open Asset, visit marketersdateflight.com forward slash open asset. Remember, your online brand is your digital footprint, so make it count. Until next time, bye for now. <laughs>